My name is Marty Kidd with Fluke Calibration. Today I'm going to be demonstrating how to use an A40B current shunt with a 5790B as a detector to actually use the corrections in the 5790B to give you the actual output um, readings from the A40B. The first thing we need to do is we need to make sure that we have the calibration data set up. If you have your calibration data, now you can actually enter in your DC resistance error off the certificate of calibration. You can enter in your AC-DC difference across the different frequencies. You can enter in your loading error. Now it's set up. I've got one amp set up on my 5730A, uh, and now I've got my corrected current output. This is the actual uh, voltage, 800 millivolts is being applied. This is the corrected output. Uh, if I switch to 100 hertz, I have my corrected output for 100 hertz. It's as easy as that. You just have to enter in your data for your uh, A40B, and the 5790B is an awesome detector uh, for use, uh, measuring current AC and DC.